What's up, everybody? My name is Lemur Actual. Um, this is going to be kind of just like a chill video, almost like a stream setup kind of going on. Uh, minimal editing, and the reason why is because I want to give the video a fair chance. Because today, if you didn't read the title yet, we're playing ESO. I'm going directly into playing ESO on PC for the first time, basically. I ran through a tutorial already, and that was it. So normally I'm used to playing on PS4. So we'll see what the differences are, and if I still think that ESO is awesome in 2024. Because I used to play it um, a long time ago, um, and I played it a lot for PS4, like I said. So anyway... Let's get right into that. I tried to remake the same character generally that I had in, um, you know, my previous gameplay. Western Skyrim, a cold place inhabited by colder people. They may disagree, but those Nords need fresh perspective. A group of vampires have mounted a shadow invasion. I hesitate to think on what they're planning. If anyone can stop them, it's you. Darn right. So, um, yeah, we're going to start here. I know, uh, I think I played through the DLC once before. Oh, snap. All right, hold up. Let's watch this in a minute. Storm straight out of Moloch's guts rose up as I returned from the troll. It twisted everyone I know into monsters. The heart thinks the skin, to talk. The eyes. The light gets too bright sometimes. The only threat to the West are those damn spies from Eastern Skyrim. Conspiring against our king. Then next you come before me to vomit up your council. Make sure it doesn't stink of treason. How many more of his people have to die before he accepts the truth and lets us help him? Iris. Fools if you think you'll survive this place on your own. I need you to do what's necessary. Because I wouldn't be able to. Okay, so this is the Western Skyrim region of Tamriel. Oh, I did not mention I'm using a, a, a graphics mod thing, reshade, or reshader or whatever. Uh, like I said, I'm, I'm used to playing on PS4, so that's all new to me, but I kind of gave it a shot and got a preset installed that I liked and everything else. So this is kind of a general test. Uh, this is with it on, by the way, running with it on. And off. Something a lot brighter. There's like less, you know, on, off. Um, heck yeah, I'm going to leave it on. I like the dark fantasy vibe it kind of gives off here. So yeah, let's stick with that. All right, let's, holy cow, let's play this game again, for crying out loud. I am playing the Arcanist class, um, which the last time I played, the Necrom expansion wasn't out. So I am trying some new stuff there. New class. Got the Way Shrine. Okay, good. Man, I don't know. It's been so long. Um, it's so cool. It it feels good. It still feels good, you know. Walking around feels like you're doing something cool. I mean, look at this world. It's so nice. All right. Um, let me see. Oh, hey. Okay, sweet. There's a quest. Let's go do that. Hey, bub. Where's that caravan? Hail, oh. stranger. I don't suppose you've seen a caravan on your travels. We've been expecting one. Stuck to the brim with supplies for the Dragon Bridge garrison. But it never arrived. How does an entire caravan go missing? Good question. This is the third time this month it's happened. We always find the wagons eventually, but strip clean of our supplies and the caravaneers run off. Excellent. It's really That's taking awesome. a toll on the garrison. We can't function like this. What do you think happened to your supplies? Not sure. Making assumptions is a little above Just my trying station. to fit in. That's a question for Captain Hingrid. If you want to help, I'm sure she'd make it worth your while. She's farther down the road, outside of town, watching for the caravan. Well, okay, I'll go talk to your commander. If the supplies don't arrive soon, there won't be much of a garrison <laughs> left. At least not a very good one. You can find Captain Hingrid on the road outside of town. With our reduced numbers, I'm sure she'd appreciate any assistance you could offer. 
Cool. I'll skip the small talk there. We'll move on. Let's just get this quest under our belt because, man, has it been a minute. Anything to kind of get me back in the game is going to be helpful. Dang, the reshader's doing some work. Dang, that looks good. It reminds me of when I started installing, like, all the ENBs for Skyrim and stuff. I do wish there was some way that you could um, do more with graphics and stuff, like the textures and everything else. I mean, Skyrim, man, Skyrim was an issue with how many mods. Like, I just got sucked into that. that there'd be so many times I'd be playing Skyrim. Uh, and when I say playing Skyrim, I mean literally just modding the game for hours. Like, just searching through Nexus mods, like, what's the coolest mods that are going on? textures, ENB presets, everything else, whatever. Man, that game was too dang much. Oh, you still pulled my stamina. But yeah. Another dead soldier and no sign of our supplies. Ah, you are Captain Hingrid. This is the third caravan this month that never made it to Dragon Bridge. And the soldier I sent to look for is dead. I'm at my wit's end. Rose blood. The garrison's remaining reserves won't last a week without an influx of fresh supplies. Lieutenant Korleva thought you could use some help. Forced to conscript civilians to do the work of the garrison? What a sorry state we've been reduced to. Well, yeah. Well, who am I to look a gifoire in the mouth? If you're willing to help, then I'm willing to help. Make a <laughs> uh, not making fun of the accent, just... Okay, I'm just a jerk, I guess. That's just how it is. We haven't heard from Solitude for a while, so I have an agent... Acquiring supplies for us from other sources. They never arrive. Later we find the wagon, ransacked and the traitors missing. Mm. If you can find the caravan, that would be a big help. I got Look you. Look for the missing caravan. See if you can determine what happened to it and who's to blame. I need to check on Ina, the caravan agent. She has a camp on the overlook, south of the bridge. Meet me there if you find any sign of the caravan. Got it. Let's get it. I'll go over here. Meet me at the overlook if you find anything. So this is kind of crazy too, because the account, my like main character that I had on PS4, like I put a lot of hours into that game on PS4. Uh, I think I was champion level like 780, something like that. And don't get me wrong, people have done more, but like that was a lot. That takes a minute. So I had other characters I played for fun, too. This arrow is flushed with feathers from a druidoc dru mountain snow owl. Suspicious. Find missing caravan. Great. Mead. Bottle of mead from the Markath Meadery. Alright, alright. But man, this feels good. It looks good. I missed it. I missed it. I'm going to cry during this video. No, I'm just kidding. I don't think I'll miss it that bad. But this is nice. It's very cool. How far is this? I don't have any mounts or anything. Like I said, I just restarted the game, okay? So, cut me some slack if you can. Uh, just here to have a chill time. Like I said, this is a not live live stream, okay? I'm just what did you keeping it chill. Ow! Stop it. Get some help. So trying to figure out the Arcanist class a little bit. Yes, I'm using a restoration staff. I have always enjoyed being a healer, uh, so I'm kind of working out that. Ina uses this camp to conduct trying business. to level stuff up. not to deal with in town. Whoever was here last certainly left in a hurry. Not exactly encouraging. Caravan was destroyed. Found this arrow. Markarth and the mead. mead. Hmm. Ina deals with Markarth. From Is that time wrong? To time, though usually indirectly. The arrow, however, it worries me. Only Reachmen use Druidak snow owl feathers to fletch their arrows. Mm. Who are the Reachmen? Why the they attack you? Reachmen come from the Reach. In the southwestern <laughs> part of Skyrim. I like how she said that. The Reachmen come from the Reach. For generations. Would they raid our caravan? 
Most certainly. But discovering their presence this far north is disturbing. Maybe it was a setup. Maybe you're, maybe they're being framed. No, but Ina must have come through here. This entire outlook is more or less her domain. Ina's got little outposts scattered everywhere up here. Look around and see if you can find any indication of where she went next. All right, I get you, I get you. A bit of a fetch quest, it seems, and that's all right. I mean, it is an MMO, after all. Um, And it's still not nearly as fetchy as some MMOs are. I would venture to say most, even. Oh, man, I do not have any AoE stuff. So uh, these fights are just going to kind of take a second. I like uh I like all the aesthetics of the Arcanist. It's pretty cool. Oh, I got like lingering stuff around me, lingering runes and stuff. That probably means something. Um I don't know that I will fully read this. Feel free to pause it if you'd like to actually read it. <gasps> Just kidding, I can't read. Okay. Moving on. Talk to Hingrid. Coming back for you, Hingrid. I know. You missed me. Ooh, a heavy sack. That me that's oh. Sounds silly, but I remember that heavy sacks are good, because they hold uh, good resources. Right? Right, guys? Is that right? <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay. It's a tough bear. Hingrid, I'm coming back to you. Well, 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 I have some things to talk to you about. Any luck? Did you find any sign of Ina? I did. I found this note. Let me see that. Ulan is Ina's right hand. She must have left this for him. Oh, damn. She really is in trouble. You check on that camp she mentioned and see if you can find her. I'll prepare the garrison for whatever's coming. Cool. Oh, I'm not sure what to think. But if the Reachmen went to all the effort to get this far north, probably for more than just raiding caravans. Be careful. Once you find Ina, meet me back in Dragon Bridge. Epic. Ina, where are you at? Find the waterfall camp. Uh oh, is this gonna kill me? Uh, no, it's fine. Is it fine? Yep, yeah, it's fine. Okay, we're good. I'm pretty sure. I don't know if this is just me or what, but I think that like all of the, um, all of like the DLC areas actually look better than the base game, which makes sense because a lot of them didn't come out until several years after but at the same time it's like almost like silly how much better they look like i said unless that's just in my head but dang there's a lot of guys here or gals actually they're oh hello oh my gosh uh help maybe a little more healing okay Focus fire. Focus fire. Hey, leveled up. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, see, now we're doing okay. Now we're doing okay. Ooh, you can just spam that. That's cool. You really can. I like that. That's fun. Ow. What, what do I... Oh... Cool. Oh yeah, it groups up the loot. Man, there's so many simple things that I'm completely forgetting about. Um, for anyone that doesn't like know the game, or you know, looking at this for like a guide or whatever, a playthrough guide of sorts. Um, to what ESO is like in 2024. Um, when there's a bunch of loot in a small area, if you just search one body, it like lumps up all of the loot in your 
inventory there automatically. So that's cool. <gasps> Ina, you've been tied up. Untie. <sighs> that's better. Now, look, we don't. Yeah, have that's time. better. These curs plan to destroy our bridge, and I just gave them exactly the information they need to do so. Why did they call you Ina White Eye? I'm just kidding. They have Ulen. They would have killed him if I didn't cooperate. I told them about the smuggling tunnels, the ones that lead to the cavern beneath the bridge's foundations. They plan to use explosives to bring oh, wow. down the bridge. What kind of explosives? The Reachman leader Rund is an alchemist. He created a powerful alchemical reagent. Mm -hmm. He's going to ignite the reagent and collapse the cavern. He's he down sure there did. now. It's called TNT. We need to warn Captain Hingrit. All right, let's go warn her. Good. The bridge is a symbol of Western Skyrim. It serves as both a vital thoroughfare yep. and a monument to our people. I really don't want to see destroyed because of my mistake. Yeah, I understand. Goodbye. It's another thing that's nice about this MMO is that everything is voice acted and pretty stinking well. I almost wish there was an option to like speed up the voices a little bit though because they are all a bit dramatic and like take their time talking through it, which is good. Like it makes for good storytelling. But if you're trying to just like buzz, you know, buzz through some quests, it's like, you know, you can do it some other time. Okay, let me see what we got. Remedy, key, Remedy Cascade. Uh, ah, here it is, okay. Channel the Abyssal Sea to coalesce a beam of restorative energy. Beam heals you and your allies in its path for 19,000 health over four and a half seconds. That's pretty stinking good. I think. I don't know. I will get it. Because like I said, I'm going to build up this whole healing situation as early as possible. So as soon as I can get into dungeons and stuff, I'm able to heal effectively. That's what I'm going for. Um, I could be putting that... Oh, that's right. Okay. So I confirm that. Something works automatically. Class. Yes. Yes. It's already a musket bar. Okay, cool, cool. Um, oh, I'm, I'm still a big boy. What do we got? Uh, claim. Yes. Let's cho oh, choose one of them. Um, I want light armor. For all my magic stuff. Okay. I'm going to be so much faster and better at this soon. <laughs> But not yet. Uh, okay. Yep. New pants. Neat. Glyph of health. Oh, yeah. That's like an enchantment. Oh, strong box. Oh, so many things. Um, I'll just take it off. I don't think any of it's stuff I need to put on right now, though. Okay. Moving on. I need to go return to Dragon Bridge. How far is that? Wow, the bloom really kind of blows out the map there, huh? Wow, that's so much different looking. Looks kind of nice, though. Okay. Um, Dragon Bridge. It, it... It does... Am I missing something? Is it not on here? Oh, it's right there. Okay, it's not there. Let's just keep going. First person view is something that... I was going to try out more. It looks good. Man, I'm so impressed with the reshader. Like I said, that's something I'm not used to using. And it's pretty sick. Eh. Yeah, I'm not even going to dodge. I'm just going to spam this. Hello. Get slapped with my green pokey runes. Yeah. Chump. I don't know if I like the rune lingering in front of my face like that in first person mode. That is a bit distracting. Station sentries on both sides of the bridge. As many as you can. Yes, Captain. Captain Hingret, I'm here. What did you find at the waterfall camp? Reachman occupied her camp. She says they plan to destroy the bridge. Destroy the bridge? While we're standing right here? How do those weak idiots expect to get that close? That's what I'm saying. With smuggler caves. They plan to collapse the cavern beneath the bridge. Smuggler caves? Under my garrison? I'll deal with Ina later. Right now we need to act fast. Deal with Ina later. Before they do whatever it is they're planning. 
I think. Wait, is that Ina? <laughs> Wait, there's a problem. Ina! Care to explain Ina. the smuggler caves beneath my garrison? What? Explain yourself. I got back here as quickly as I could. The Reachmen. I heard something troubling as I made my way out of the camp. What'd you hear? It's not just the bridge that's in danger. The Reachmen intend to utilize the smuggler cave entrances to surround the town. They're going to attack the garrison. Oh. How do we stop them? If the Reachmen can use explosives, so can we. Gather the Tindal pitch and fire salts from the garrison barn. I'll get yes. it. I'll mark the entrances on your map. Use the fire salt and Tindal pitch at each location. Okay. Then Sounds great. All right. Get get the stuff. Just get the stuff. That's what she wants me to do. I'll get the stuff. I got you. Uh, Kindle pitch. And in this barrel, fire salts. Alright. Uh, go do the thing. I need to go up this way. Seal the smuggling bolt holes. I like the quest tracker quite a bit in this game, especially compared to other MMOs. The compass situation feels a little bit like Skyrim. It's nice. It's good. Oh, hello there. Get hit with some runes, nerd. Ow, I'm the nerd. Dang it. I need to, like, block. There's so many things I gotta remember how to do. Um... Ooh, that's good for me. Uh, I'm gonna throw that on real quick. So I'll sash up Magicka. Oh, heck yeah. Adds a bunch of magic. Reduce the cost of block. <laughs> Joke's on you. I don't know how to block. I'm just kidding. I, I do. I just gotta remember to actually do it. Um, seal. Yep. Well. Alright. That'll do. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, do, 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 don't mind me. I'm just blowing up holes in your cave system that you are surely not currently using as you're about to ambush us. Avoid the bears. Avoid the bears! Uh, okay, here we are. Hey, nerds. <laughs> Block. See, look, guys, I did it. I figured it out. Not so bad, right? Could be worse. Oh, oh, that's a cool little, that's a cool little move you got there, friend. Boom. Yeah, boy, got it. I sealed up your holes. Is that Jay-Z? Or was that, um... What the heck is his name? Travolta. <laughs> you tell me. Oh. It's down here. Eh, this is a little more dangerous. Uh, nope, we're fine. Everything's good. Ooh. Cold. I don't know how many of you guys have ever, you, you know, like the polar plunge situation or anything even similar, right? I remember when I was a kid, we had a swimming pool and it was like early spring and the thing wasn't heated and it was like 50 degrees Fahrenheit that is. Um, and I don't know what that is in Celsius cause I'm just dumb. Um, but I, I got in this pool when it was 50 degrees and I felt like I was going to die. Like, it was so cold. So, yeah, I don't know if you guys... I can't imagine ever doing something like a polar plunge. There's no way. You'd, it'd be, like, paralyzing as soon as you touch the water. Just saying. I'll sneak past these guys. Oh, I remember how to sneak. That was, like, instinct right there. All right, can't sneak past this guy. Can't sneak past this guy. Or gal, rather. Oh my 
got you. I got you, bro. No, stop. All right, I'll take Donnie. <laughs> All right, you. You don't look like these Tuscan reach bastards. Yeah, Ina sent me. Ina wouldn't give up on me. I got I you. Do to deserve her. These skinny weaklings are setting up explosives farther in the cave. I'll deal with the explosives. You get to safety. I won't forget this. Now untie me so I can get my sorry hide out of here. Your hide is very sorry. I mean, I wasn't gonna mention it, but since you said it, I mean, I just want you to, i just give you some confirmation, you know? Your hide is dreadfully sorry. Block. <laughs> get blocked. Well, how do you, oh, you, oh, yeah, double tap. Stop. Uh, okay, that one. It'd be really embarrassing if I died, because this is, like, the most easy thing ever, just doing some questing stuff. Um, but I could do it. Don't want to pass me. Um. What? Oh, wow. I was looking at my mouse, thinking it was me on the map. Okay. So I just need to basically just follow this thing. It's a big old loop. All right. Easy enough. Easy enough. <laughs> Combat basics. <laughs> Pretty good. Heck yeah. Oh yeah, your skills level up. Oh my gosh, so many things. Your skills level up over time with use and... Actually, I don't even think you technically have to use them. I think you just have to have them slotted on your bar. But they get better as they level up. And then you can morph them and do a bunch of cool stuff. I forgot all about that. Uh, I keep pressing the wrong buttons for that. By the wrong buttons, the wrong click, but I'll like just kind of panic and click on both instead of doing it the right way. Uh, oh. Okay, alright, alright, moving on. There's probably a sky shard in here somewhere. I should be on the lookout for that. Ah, oh, dang it, there's so many. Alright. You're done. Uh, I might avoid those guys. Yeah, I'm just gonna avoid all that. Shh. Don't let them know how awesome I am. Don't tell them. They want my autograph. Why you? Why you dead? What's wrong with you? Get up off the ground. Wake up. Nap time's over. I wish I could take her torch. Is that a thing in this game? Can you use torches? I really don't remember. Uh, okay, have to go this way, so I guess I'll just go over here. Hello. Oh, whoops. All right. See, I keep doing them backwards. I keep trying to do the interrupt thing instead of break free. I said that backwards. Heal up a little bit. Defuse the bomb. Mm-hmm. Good, 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 good. Sneak up this way. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think there's any way to avoid fighting these guys. Whoops. That was the wrong hotkey. Ow. Whoa, bro, you just summoned a bear. That seems hardly fair. I can't do that. I can't summon bears. Then again, I did just vanquish, uh, like, some weird Daedric snake lady in the tutorial, so... I guess... Being able to conjure a bear isn't that crazy.
I do think that's kind of funny in the tutorial. The lady's just like, there's this Daedric being that I'm only going to let you out of this cage if you help me beat it. It's like, okay, Daedric being, huh? Listen, I'm level one. All right. I'm not ready. Oh Lord Vund. Or Vund. I don't know. You gonna get You gonna get slapped up here, Vund. You ain't gonna be looking good after this. Oh, did run. See? Too late. <laughs> so you're completely done casting. Whatever. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. Pow! Gotcha, nerd. <laughs> Not so tough. Oh, sweet. New restoration staff. I'll take it. These are also better. Yep. Cool. New stuff. Love new stuff. Alright, that's diffused. I can get out of here. Talk to the captain. Hingrid. The Captain Hingrid. I should keep going this way because I haven't seen a Sky Shard yet, and it may very well be on the other side that I haven't gone through yet. But for the first time in a long time, I need Sky Shards. I feel like such a newbie, newbie noob chump. It's crazy. But it's okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Hello, friends. It's very good to meet you. I like your swords. Nice swords. Oh, and you. And your ability to cast spooky magic. Well, I mean, you would be buds, you know? We can be friends, because I cast spooky magic. Just hang out together, have little play dates, and talk about uh, spooky magic boys. I mean, why not? Someone's got to talk about spooky magic boys. Ingrid. it's good to see you, my friend. I feared the worst when the witness started pouring out of the cave. Since you're here and the bridge is still standing, I assume your mission was a success? That's right. Yep. Bridge is safe Excellent. now. Excellent. Hopefully after all this trouble, we can convince Solitude to make our lives a little easier. Thank you, friend. Your actions likely saved the Western Hall. I promise you, your triumph will not go unsung. Sweet. An intricate plot by the Reachmen. This doesn't bode well for Western Skyrim. I need to warn Solitude. After this, they have to provide the support we were promised long ago. For their own sake, if not for ours. Do you think Solitude will finally provide the supplies you need? They better. What happened here will be hard to ignore. They might not tell stories of your bravery, but I think they'll send us what we need. And for the rest, we have enough. <laughs> That's enough. All right. Have a good one, Ina. Nope, Ingrid. That's awkward. <laughs> okay. Well, I feel like that uh, was a solid little intro quest there. You know, I've gotten a, got the hang of this game a little bit now. Um, got leveled up a little bit more. Put some more points in. Magicka all the way. Let's go. Claim some skill points and stuff. Yep, yep, yep. Magicka. Oh, let's go. That's a lot of points. All right, commit. Yes, confirm. Um, I can morph this now. Oh my gosh, what is that? All right, what are my options here? So it's going from evolving rune mend. Uh, okay. What's this do? New effect heals for an additional amount over time. Okay. So it's the same deal. Yeah, okay. Craft a series of adaptive apocryphal runes. Then propel them at yourself or an ally in front of you. The runes heal for 2,311 health three times. Uh, three times. Cool. I didn't realize that. 
an additional 2,000 health over six seconds and generate crux. Oh my gosh, I have to look at what that means. E oh, each active crux reduces the cost of this ability by 3%. Oh, cool. So I can spam this. This becomes a spam heal. Kind of. I mean, that's kind of what they're trying to promote there. Or, a uh, new effect, healing low health targets grants them ultimate. Oh, that's pretty cool. So this is like a, a bit of a damage buff under 50%. Honestly, my goal is to not let anyone even get to that point personally. I was that good with the Templar healer, but the Templar is really made for healing. I'm going to stick with this one. You can always respec stuff later, so stick with this one. Heck yeah. Cool. Um, that's that for now. Weapons. Restoration staff. Oh yeah, I got some stuff to get here too. Grand healing is important. Honestly, I'm going to need all of them, but I'm going to start here. I know I use that one. There we go. I'm stacked. I got healing off the wazoo, if you will. Cool. Sweet. Well, guys, thanks for hanging out. This has been pretty fun. Um, I would really appreciate it if you uh, like this video. Hit subscribe. It's not that hard. And I need a lot more subscribers. I'm starting fresh, so... Help me out. Share this around, too, if you like it. Um, also, I'll be making plenty more things for ESO. I plan to do a bunch of live streaming stuff, too, and I'll probably keep up shorts as well. Um, keep up shorts. I'll keep my shorts up, too. Um, and that way you get to see everything you want to see and what you don't want to see, probably. Anyway, thanks again. Bye.